Hey everybody, I'm excited to have you join me here once again, and today we're going to learn some signs. Perhaps you have a deaf family member or a friend, maybe a neighbor or a coworker, however, whichever. You're just really wanting to roll up your sleeves and start to learn to sign. I'm just really happy you're here and I'm proud of you. And thanks for taking your first step forward to get to starting to learn so you can make your the world and your local community more accessible for the deaf. Well, my name's Melissa and I'm a CODA, which means I'm a child of deaf adults, which means is I'm hearing and I grew up in the deaf world using deaf culture and ASL. Today in this video, I'm gonna be teaching you how to sign different questions, question words. Some, I'll be adding some, some words so you could use to apply and sign your, with your learning throughout this video. And hold up, at the end of this video, I'm adding a bonus for you to practice when I sign and you could respond. So let's start. Oh wait, hold up. You can support me by clicking subscribe, which is that little button there in the corner. You can like or make a comment, whichever. Share with your friends or family. It's really up to you. If you really want a true ASL immersed uh, experience, hit the mute button. It'll be a Voices Off silent experience. Now you can watch this all the first time with the audio. Go back and hit mute. Now this video is part two of a series of videos, a variety of ones that I'm going to be making for basic conversation sign skills. Now, if you haven't already, go back to check out the video in part one. But if you're ready, let's go ahead and learn some questions. Let's do this. One thing you need to remember in ASL, it's not the same as English, like a spoken language. It's very different. Most of you, the um, in most sentence forms, you'll put the topic first. For example, book. Who? Not whose book is that? Really, I mean, it is used out there, but the true form would be book who. Your name what? So anyway, let's proceed. Who? What? It's important to remember the eyebrows to raise and furrow them. Where? When? Kind of like a time clock going around the clock. <laughs> How? Why? You. Or are you? It's the same thing as do you and are you are the same. Are isn't a word in ASL, but the expressions match. Raise your brows. Are you? Which one? Question or question mark. What are you doing? What are you doing? Or <laughs> you could use a deaf slang and just do this. That face matching this little hand shape here. Do do do. What are you doing? <laughs> okay, now those are the words that relate to question signs. Let's stop, go look at the list down below, and make sure you know them before you move on. Um, this next section I'm going to teach you some things, like some nouns, just to give you some words that you can ask about for your practice. That. We'll start with that. Now that is a very popular sign to be using. So here it is. Book looks like a book. Cup. To drink from a cup. Phone. Keyboard or typing. Pen or to write. It's also the action for writing, you see. Paper. Now, if you think in um, more of ASL, you would expand and elaborate what it would look like. Like a book is this thick, a book is this shape, or a book is tiny and you can turn the pages. A cup is small, a cup is tall, a cup is ginormous. 
Now the phone, so the shape of the phone. Pen, it's a long skinny tool, pen. Keyboard, and here's the shape. Paper is a rectangle, or paper is a tiny little piece, or paper's ginormous. What's the paper that you need? Okay, now let's practice with your new words. Some will be signed words that will go with your nouns. Your name what? Your name what? You eat what? You can sign like I'm eating nothing. You eat what? The response, I eat nothing. Book, who? Book, who? The response is, my book, my book. Happy, who? Happy, who? You can sign, you're happy, you're happy. <laughs> Phone, where? Phone, where? You could gesture, phone is right here in my bag. <laughs> Cup, where? Cup, where? You can reply, my cup is over there. Or my cup is over there. Or my cup is right here. My cup's right here. Meet, meet you when? Meet you when. Eat. When. Now, don't worry, you're going to learn more on how to reply on different types of questions. How are you? This is a little bit of a special, unique rule. Um, people don't typically say you how. Um, well, they do, but I think it's a little flexible. And the last sentence, you sad, why? You sad, why? You could sign, because you're happy, or you're happy, why? Uh-huh, you happy, why? Question. So your practice is, I'm gonna sign a question, and you're gonna sign and reply back. Well, that's all we've got today. Go to the drop down box and practice those list of words. On every single video I upload, you'll improve every time. Well, thanks for learning with me. My name's Melissa, and this is my sign name, and I'm with You Can Sign Too. See you next time on part three. Until then, make sure you go back and practice. Take care. Bye bye.